Yeah, welcome to our little tutorial concerning the lateral light exposure unit and the SR3000. You can see that you have to remove the um, the plastic hose and the black blanket from it um, to get started. That's how it works. This is the artwork, completely high dense black. Uh, and that's a photoresist. So you have to lay down the plastic side on the black blanket. So the dull side is on top. Now you have to lay down the printed side of the artwork to the matte side, to the dull side of the photoresist. And now you have to close the system again. So it's pretty tight, so you need a little strength. So that's it. Now the UV light can go through the artwork to the film. So just close it and here you have the clock. So that's a manual timer, it's not digital. So you have to turn it to the right to start it. And after 20 seconds, you can see, I can count to 20. <laughs> after 20 seconds, you have to turn the knob to the left again with a little pressure. So pretty brutal. Yeah. See, that's wrong side, right, to the left. Okay, now we can switch it off. So it's a, it's a manual clock. So this unit is on the market in 30 years. But it works. It works great, much better than any other. So here you see, you see nothing. So that's a manual clock. Turn it to the right to get started. That's one minute approximately. And after 20 seconds, you have to turn it back to zero to stop the UV light. Now you have to wash out. So rinse out the film properly until it's completely transparent. So here I'm using a, a special flat spray nozzle which we are building for our customers. So that's uh, right from the tap. So it's a flat spray nozzle with a small diameter. So it can work out the finest details. So lines and half tones and whatever. So it takes let's say about a minute if you take warm water or one and a half if you take co uh, cold water but you can see how it works so it must be completely clean no blue emulsion in the uh, in the unexposed areas so everything what is here developed so washed away that was um, hidden from the artwork so no UV light came through. That's the reason why it's so clear. So if you have further questions, please contact us. Thank you for listening.